classroom and has a tremendous amount of experience with a two and two record so far this year. OJ Clark catch the bait. We need to go answer. Rogers, wide open receiver is Jaleel Scott, the big. Take a look at Ty Rogers, senior quarterback. That ball's in the air before the receiver. A timing, anticipation. He is money with the ball. Into heavy traffic, and it's incomplete as he was. Rolls Royce Freeman out at Oregon, and Justin Jackson, the only current running backs in college football with more rushing yards. Rogers. That's what I'm talking about. Rose, the only second Aggie ever with over 4,000 yards as Huntley comes into the game, picks up the block, and Rogers. Yes, indeed. I should have. I was awake at 5.30 this morning watching that Washington State USC finish. First and 10. Rodgers has a wide open receiver down to the 15 yard line and that's Scott again who gets behind the secondary for 21 yards. Making the most of a turnover. That's what this team does. They're now plus four in the turnover department. And turnover margin. And they Visit to Fayetteville to watch her compete against the Razorbacks. Met with Brett Bielema. They had an opening and the rest is history. Second and 11 and Rodgers will take off. It was slower than he would like of making that move. Third and seven, little blitz there, and it's incomplete as they... The nice afternoon for Arkansas. I got my tens mixed up. It's only the third touch for Larry Rose in this game. Doug Martin wanted to get in 30. Wide open in the middle of the field is Jaleel Scott, the big receiver. He's been busy. Four catches, 64 yards near the midway part of the second quarter. Rodgers, a bullet again, and that's to the 25-yard. Giving him about a 10-yard cushion, but watch this route. Nice and flat. Doesn't really bubble up the field or start to drift upfield. He keeps I did a lot of games at Purdue when he was the head coach. There's your thoughts go out to his family. Tyler Rodgers escapes the pocket, loads up down the field. Comes right back down the line, down the stem. For Tyler Rogers. That's 24 yards with all kinds of time for protection. Now deep down the field and it's batted down as Santos Ramirez gets a hand trying to cover Jaleel Scott. Yeah, excellent play on the back end by Ramirez, but this one you got to go up with your hands. He's waiting for the ball to come down into him. You've got to go up and snatch that thing out of the air. That's where you want big guys, especially a guy like Jaleel Scott. At 6'6", 215, go up. There is for making a nice play on the back end as well. Had an interception against TCU a couple of weeks ago. Rodgers escapes again, continues to survey, and finds an open receiver inside the 25-yard line. That's Jaleel Scott again. Wide open on a, a throw and, or a catch and run. To the end zone, the fade, and nobody's home. They also wanted him to carry the ball about 20 times, so 30 total touches, but he is well off that pace for New Mexico State. He gets the football here, and he gets right past. And then a misread at the end of the first half, that should have been a touchdown pass. 15 yards to go along with it. Second and eight. All day again. Rodgers escapes underneath, and it's a positive play to Jaleel Scott. Just over eight yards here. I now understand what that means. Players show him their full of respect and attention. In completion, he would definitely coach the special teams in all four units just to make sure that he's getting his message across. Third and ten for Rodgers, and this guy... Again, Doug Martin said he wanted 30 touches for Larry Rose, and he has only eight. It's a one-on-one -on -one ball that is caught by Scott. The seven-yard line. Right here, let's see. Climbs the ladder. Ball's right in there, and that's, that foot is in right there. It's inbounds. 38 yards in this last one is reviewed, and it is upheld. Rodgers near the end zone, Jaleel Scott again. Defense can 
come together, find some stops. This is what happens. Excellent move. He sells Ramirez on.